we go. Pitch successful. Box him. Box him. This is the case. He fast. I don't have it. Oh, just huge. 1050 into another car. Wow. Still cleared. He's the only one. Get it. Oh my god. Shots fired. Shots fired. What the hell happened? Oh. Oh, shit. This guy's got a gun. Hey, uh, get back in your vehicle, sir. Oh, shit! Shot fired, shot fired! Shot Hello, everybody. So, Calthero here. Welcome back to another episode of LSPDFR. Today, we are going to take out the last vehicle that I have in the uh, Los Santos County Police Pack that I have, which is the Ford Taurus. Uh, we're actually running a little late in the episode. I meant to get a screenshot for the thumbnail for this video and I accidentally accepted a call out at the same time. So we're actually in a hurry right now. We're going to be responding to a house robbery over in uh, the Del Piero Pier, I guess, or Del Piero Freeway, somewhere over there. Which is okay because I was coming out of this station here, but I wanted to uh, patrol in Vespucci, so... Lo and behold, it actually worked out in our favor. It's kind of going to the direction we want to go to. Um, so we're heading out to that right now. Obviously, we're going to be uh, in this patrol. We're going to be taking call outs, but uh, we'll look for traffic violations as well if they occur in front of us and uh, have a chat with people that uh, do have that happening. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and make the turn here. It looks like it's just it's literally on the freeway. Okay. Whoops, I always do this. Even in single player, I always think this road is right here. Yeah, sorry, I know, oncoming lanes. So it looks like it's one of the houses right off the highway there. So I'm not sure how this is gonna work. I don't believe I have open interiors installed right now, so I don't know if that's gonna be an issue or not. All right, everybody's uh, heat and wave for me here. I'm gonna go ahead and, ooh, get some frame droppage, but I'm gonna reduce down and then I'm gonna pull over here and uh, see what's going on. We got some sort of house break-in robbery going on. So actually, it's the next one up. All right, uh, let's get our gun out. Let's go ahead and uh, get a backup unit out here too, just to be on the safe side. Backup required on Del Perro Freeway. Wait till my backup gets here. Wherever they are. Oh, they're coming out of the parking lot. They were actually staging down the street, it looks like. Just kind of keep my eye in the backyard here. Seems like the front door is right there. Let me see. Is there a... Okay, there is a door over here, too. Come on, dude, kill your siren. Let's go. Holy hell. That, was that visual. Yeah, come on, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Got a door. Can't enter it. Kill our light. Police buddy is guarding in a suspect. What? I haven't even made contact yet. Can I get in through this door? No. Nope. Okay. Door's locked. Upstairs. Oh, shit! Save that light. Come on. Uh, nope. Nothing here. I'm backing you up. Yep. Just keep on backing me up then. Nothing here. Whoa, missed the stairway. Hey. Alright. Uh maybe you can get in that door. I doubt it though, looking at it. Alright, nothing there. Hello. Oh. Uh hello. Yeah, I don't know if it's gonna let me uh do this or not. I don't have open interior, so I can't, like, just get into here. 
no, no way over there. I got your back. And the person, according to the mini map, is on this level, so I need to find a door of some kind. Let's see. Got nothing over here. And then we're down here on the ground level again. Well, that's a bummer. I don't think I can. Uh, I don't think I can do this call out because I don't have open interiors. I wonder if there's a way through the trainer you can uh, clip through. Uh, restricted areas enabled. I don't know if that's something I should. Uh, not seeing anything that would let me get through a door of any kind or a wall. Hello. Yep, not seeing it. Okay. Well, I'm for. Well, wait. Oh, Maybe teleporting has it. Uh, no. Hello. Yep, not seeing it. Okay. Well, unfortunately, uh, we're not going to be able to do this call out, so we're just going to go ahead and end it if I can. Put our gun away. Oh, I'm going to have to do it this way. We have there a we 503 on Playa Vista. And we're not going to take that call just because it wasn't naturally given to us. It was just uh, me trying to force one. So we dismissed our partner. We're going to unfortunately have to be code 4 off of this because we uh, can't enter the building. And then we'll be back out 10-8. We've got suspects are fleeing the crime. An attempted kidnapping on Del Perro Freeway. All right, so we got an attempted kidnapping going on right now. Response code 1. Oh, they want us to respond just regular response here, so we will respond code one sort of, but we'll do some uh, code two driving though too. Woo! Catching some air there. Well, it looks like we're heading back towards where we were originally. As you can see, the callout is still on my screen. I can't get rid of it from that one with the uh, open interiors. All right, got the lights off. What's up? Black Burrito 3, or Black Van, basically. Your car's not working. See if we could see him anywhere. Pretend we're turning left here. It looks like he's actually driving on the beach. Based on the position of the circle. Oh, we're gonna get off here and see. Ooh, that guy kinda made a last minute ditch. Nice car. Hmm, not on the beach. Gave me the slip. We must be. I guess we'll continue down this way, see if we, uh,. Have any luck finding it. Oh wait, there's a van right there. And it is black. I think that's him. Yep, that's him. I need this car to turn off or out of the way. Ah, perfect. Thank you. What's up, man? Alright, just when we get past these cars, we'll uh, order him to pull over. Okay, he's uh, not trying to be incognito here with his driving. What is that about? He's like pulling up on the left of this guy. Don't get him for that. 
114 to dispatch. I have that black van. Uh, we're currently facing east on Magellan Avenue. Yeah, he can't pull over because the guy in front of him is being an idiot. Okay, well, that's as good as it's going to get. Uh, we're going to go ahead and ask for a felony stop on these guys just in case. Helicopter backup required on Conquistador Street. Yeah, we just want to play it safe here. Get the air unit up. Rolling in from the southeast. I'm going to be right on top of them any second now. Got the Vic here. I want me to go talk to him, so I don't want to break it by doing a felony we stuff. Hey, how's it going, boss? You were uh, kind of having a hard time there with maintaining the lane when you were supposed to be at a stop. You got your license, registration, and Just proof of insurance? That'll do. All right, cool. Uh, where are you heading to? You're on your way home? Oh, right on. Where are you coming from? I have the right to remain silent. Yes, you do. That's a good thing that you know your rights. Uh, why don't you go ahead and just sit tight and I'll be right back with you. Alright, I don't think I could break it now because I did that. So, let's try. Alright, get out of the vehicle. Let's see your hands. Jesus, we're shooting him already? I don't see a gun. We don't need to be shooting him. Oh, he does have a gun. Never mind. Drop the gun, dude. Drop it. Drop your gun. Drop your gun. There you go. Alright, let's go ahead and arrest him. Man, he's in uh, pretty rough shape. Shouldn't have pulled the gun on us, dude. that go ahead and stand right there there's the guy that was uh tied up whoops didn't mean to do that at least stand behind the victim and press y okay What's where you going? i got you dude here you go and i'll talk to the victim to get their statement oh i gotta get in front of him that makes sense hey are you all right thanks officer i'm fine all right can you tell me what happened I was walking in and suddenly he forced me into it to enter his van. All right, go on. He cuffed me and put me in the back of the vehicle. Okay, thanks for your statement. Anything I could do to help? I'm injured. Please, could you call an ambulance for me? Okay. Yeah, I'll uh, call you an ambulance right now. Ambulance will be coming shortly. Cool. And there's the ambulance. All right, let's go ahead and pat this dude down real quick. I'm gonna have my partner pat him down and I'm gonna actually search the vehicle. See if there's anything I need to be concerned with in here. Uh, nothing really. A handgun, two severed fingers, and a chef knife. Okay. Alright, so he's got some, uh,. He's got some stuff with him. I'm gonna just go ahead and leave him cuffed for now so we could do a case on him. Let's uh go ahead and get a tow truck out here for this thing. Tow truck. Assistance required on Conquistador Street. Alright, let's go ahead and get Bobby Jenkins driving with a suspended license too. Well, there you have it. Driving while license is suspended. Um Legal possession of a firearm because he's not supposed to have one. And let's see it. It's probably under here, I would assume. Nope, I guess not. Oh, here we go. Uh, attempted kidnapping. Or kidnapping, I guess, because he did have him. Okay. So, we're going to go ahead and submit the charges on him. 
Oh, he does have a gun permit, a concealed carry, but only for long guns. So that that handgun is not something he should have. So uh, he's going to get hit with that. Let's go ahead and uh, have one of my backup units here take him away. Oh, tow truck's got his van now. Actually, I don't want to have one of my backup units take him away. I want an ambulance to come pick him up just because he's... It's been shot multiple times trying to pull a gun on us. I'll go ahead and dismiss all uh, all of my backup. Alright, my backup's taking off. The ambulance is getting on scene. Let's try to clear this off here. Yep, there they go. They're taking him. Let me pull out of the way here so everybody can start clearing out. Yep, they're gonna take him away. Check over his uh, wounds to make sure they're not life-threatening for when he got shot. And then uh, he'll be going to jail afterwards for those charges. So we're gonna be code four, and we'll be back out 10-8 off of this one. We've got citizens reporting a civilian in need of assistance on Del Perro Freeway. All right, so now we got a attempted rape going on here. Uh, the victim is disoriented and walking with minimal clothing. Okay. So we're going to... Oh, jump our tourists. We're responding code two right now. There's the ambulance taking away the guy that uh, had attempted kidnapping. Oh, that's not my turn. I hate this road. I always get lost on it. There we go. Alright, looks like he or she is down here. We're just gonna make our way up the highway and then we'll circle back around and uh, see if we can identify and locate them. Alright, so somewhere along here there's somebody confused and disoriented that has minimal clothing on like they've been... Uh, Attacked. Uh, there's somebody walking out in the middle of the freeway. And, yep. Okay. I got eyes on him. Hey, ma'am, are you okay? Officer, please help me. A man just pulled me into his car and attempted to rape me. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Do you have any information about him? He's driving a silver felon. The license plate started with 07 William. Okay. Are you injured in any way? Yes, I'm injured. I need medical attention. Could you call an ambulance? Sure thing. I can call you an ambulance. There you go. Call in an ambulance. I'm not sure when they're going to get here. Because they're way over there. Uh. Where are they going? They're trying to find the way over here, I think. They gotta drive all the way up there. Oh, now they're over here. Can't seem to figure it out. Let's do this. Why don't, uh, why don't you come with me real quick? We're gonna have you... Uh, we're gonna put you over here so you're not in the middle of the highway, okay? Oh, here comes the ambulance. Never mind. We'll bring you right here. Right here, right here, right here, right here. Alright, she's in the ambulance now. Hopefully I didn't break my game doing that. Alright, let's clear traffic off. Target vehicle license plate. Zero Suspect's seven, vehicle. William oh. R. John, seven, four, eight. Silver Felon has been last seen in this area. Okay, we're uh, on our way. It looks like... They got up the road quite a way, so we're uh, trying to catch up right now so we can find that vehicle. All right, so we're looking for a silver fill. Oh, that's him. Yep, there he is. I got eyes. 
Dispatch, we got eyes on the perp. Oh, and he is fleeing, and he made a big mistake. He pulled out right in front of the police station. Why are you guys chasing him on foot? Get in your cruisers. All right, he just 1050 with the parked car. We're heading north on Rockford Drive right now. Uh, none of my backup units are coming with me. Oh, we just 1050 with another car. Holy hell, that was bad. All right, let's go ahead and get some backup units out here. Marathon Avenue and Del Perro. Uh, speeds are over 80 miles per hour going up Prosperity Street. Just 1050 hard into a truck and a food truck. That's it. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Let's see your hands, dude. Let's see the hands. Hey, hey, hey. Stop running. Stop running. Let me see your hands. Get down on your knees and place your fingers behind your head. All right. We got him in custody. Man, this guy... Hard hit both of those trucks. I hope they're okay. That was that was a pretty heavy hit. All right, let's get him out of this side of the road. Suspecting custody. No further units required. Hey, we're trying, man. Calm down. All right, stand right here. Just stay right there, sir. Can you step out for me? Yeah, are you all right? You guys want to step out for me too, both of you? Sir, can you step out too? Citizens reporting use of explosives. Nope. I'm busy right now. This guy hit these guys hard. You got your ID on you, man? Are you okay? That'll do. All right, you got any injuries or anything like that? I'm nearby. I'll take the call for you. I guess I can't uh, ask anything like that. You own the vehicle? Yes, it is beautiful. Okay, just sit tight. Sir, are you okay? You're not hurt or anything, are you? You got your ID on you? That'll do. They send me All right, cool. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, have you take a seat back in the truck, okay? This is fucked up. All right. Um, your truck seems like it's good, so I'm gonna go ahead and have you uh, take your truck from here, okay? Sir, do you got your ID on you? Kiflong. Narcotic intoxication. There it is. I'm not trying to deal with that right now. All right, uh, you can go ahead and return to your vehicle, sir. Maldita. Man, that was a hard hit. He blew his hood open and he hit it so hard. All right, let's go ahead and pat this dude down real quick. Keep this road closed. Handgun, a gag, and a condom. There it is. He was definitely trying to rape somebody. He does have a gun, gun permit, though. Oh, Let's see what we got here. He's got a gun permit concealed for handguns. So the handgun's not illegal. He's good there. But, um, yeah, he's he's facing some uh, serious charges. Um, there's sexual assault, but is there something attempted rape there it is right there all right so he's getting charged with that today oh he had a suspended license too damn it i missed that part all right i'm gonna have pt come pick him up while i search his vehicle too a couple of grenades a hammer okay yeah this guy was up to no good Go ahead and get a tow truck out here for his vehicle. Tow truck. Assistance required on Prosperity Street. Alright, looks like uh, PT's coming right now. I'm gonna try to clear this road up a little bit, get this extra lane going. Tow truck's here and he's gonna get his vehicle right now. And there's PT. Cool. Yep, got one for you. Yep, there we go. All right, cool. He's in custody, so now we're available for calls. So we're going to be code 4 off of this, and uh, we're going to be back out 10-8. All 
All right, we got drug dealers on the run in Del Perro. So we're heading over there right now, code three, some sort of drug deal going on. Uh, not sure what to expect here. Let's see, heading code three there. And uh, I noticed my quality of my video was stuttering, so I do apologize that the audio got lost for a little bit there. Hopefully this fixed it by restarting it. So we are in an active pursuit right now with this vehicle. It's a black bison truck, Occupy times one. Uh, we're heading over into Rockford Hills right now. We're on Movie Star Way. Yep, we got a few backup units showing up. Uh, they don't seem to know where they're going. This is kind of all over the place. Oh, he's out. He's out. I'm not sure if he's got a gun or not, but I'm moving up ahead here. Prowling him back to you. Oh, no. He kept going. He kept going. All right. Hands are up. All right, looks like they got him. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so... Oh, my goodness, the frames. They are dropping. All right, let's go ahead and pat him down, make sure he doesn't have anything on him. Pupils are dilated, so he's definitely high. Uh, a used needle. Oh, that's not good. Let's go ahead and do the drug swab test on him. That'll do. That'll do. Positive for marijuana. I mean, that's not a crime, although he was driving under the influence. Have this officer stay with him while I check his vehicle out. Uh, he lucked out. His vehicle actually didn't uh, get damaged, it looks like. And we'll uh, get a plate check on it, too. Target Go ahead and search it. Plate. No insurance. Charles. Crowbar, glass cutting equipment, pair of shoes, a baseball Charles bat. Charles Henry, Niner Zero Eight. A traffic violation. Approach tow truck. Caution. Assistance required on Marathon Avenue. So I'm gonna get a tow truck to tow that out of here. I'm not gonna do the paperwork on this because it said a drug dealer, but I haven't found drugs on him other than he's uh, high on marijuana, Assistance but that's required. it. And Rockford Hills. I mean, I don't have any evidence supporting that he. Uh, he was dealing drugs. Uh, so while they're coming to pick him up, we're, we're going to go ahead and view our court cases here. Uh, the first one we got is Bobby Jenkins. Uh, this was the guy that was driving with his license suspended. He had illegal possession of a firearm, and uh, he was the person that was trying to kidnap that other gentleman. Uh, he was fined $3,985, and he was sentenced to nine years in prison. Legal possession of a firearm was not guilty. I might have seen that incorrectly, so that's uh that one's on me. I can actually I can accept that one. Uh, the next case is for Jimmy Trials, and this is for the guy that it was attempting to rape that woman that we found out on the freeway. Uh, he was fined five thousand dollars and was given a two-year prison sentence. So he's gonna be doing some pretty hard time. I'm gonna move my car over here and I'm gonna shut my light off so this way this uh, bystander can get go. Oh, no, PT's just gonna smack into him too. <laughs> but uh, anyways guys, that's gonna do it for this episode of LSPDFR and that's probably gonna do it for this vehicle pack for the LSPD. Uh, the, one that, the ones I've been using for the Sheriff's Department too is probably gonna be gone as well. Uh, we should have some new vehicles here shortly. Obviously, I pre-record ahead of time, so that way I can meet my schedule, but I think I'm also going to change out the siren. As much as I like hearing it, because it's usually what I hear locally, um, it's probably best if I change it up and change that out, too. So, thanks again, guys, for watching. Uh, please let me know again down in the comments below what you thought, and until next time, a police car is being stolen. <laughs> uh, take care.